So we built ourselves a Yeti. We were starting to build a polar bear and then it just turned into a Yeti. And I don't know how or a why or anything like that, but it definitely looks like a Yeti to me. It's got its legs, little arms, um, blue face. Uh, actually, have you seen the movie advertisements for Littlefoot? It actually looks like the Yeti or the Bigfoot in Littlefoot. Um, so I think it turned out fairly well for a, for a Yeti. It didn't really turn out so well for a polar bear, honestly. Um, didn't have the snout. And uh, our, we tried sleep, the sleeping version. It was okay, but this is definitely a better build. Uh, definitely more like what we were trying to build, which is a Yeti. Honestly, it turned out to be a Yeti much more than a polar bear. So I think that was a good build. Um, make sure to like and subscribe down below. And uh, also, uh, if you guys got any suggestions of what we should be building here on the channel, make sure to leave a comment as to what you would like to see us build. Okay, let's uh, let's go check out how I built this Yeti in about five minutes of time. Let's go check it out. So polar bear, let's jump right into the polar bear. Now, I'm going to switch it to bear and not just polar bear. And the reason is, is we don't have that many white pieces, but maybe we will. Maybe it'll turn out to be more of a polar bear. But we're going to put five minutes on the clock. Let's pull the white in here. Oh, we got to zoom out. We're way close because of that penguin last episode. Um, this is all the whites that we have. Maybe we can build bear out of this. I don't know. I'm thinking we're going to have to add some of the browns as well, but we'll see. Okay, so maybe it's got a barrel belly, right? Maybe we can use these for its belly. Okay, so we got a belly of the polar bear. And now we got the shoulders of the polar bear. Okay. Now, more importantly, we got to do a face. And it's winter time, so maybe that polar bear is sleeping. Sitting up and sleeping at the same time. What do you think? Something like that? So there we go. We got a sleeping face to the polar bear. And uh, how are we going to make sure that we have that well supported here? Switch this out. Get the white there. And then that's going to be like that. You know, it's kind of like snuggled up there and sleeping, right? So now we got to do like legs coming out like that somehow. Because it's a sleeping polar bear, right? I mean, actually, that's not bad. <laughs> Just sitting it up like that. A little offset. Uh, doesn't scream polar bear. I got to put some arms or something like that on here. Hmm. Is that a polar bear? What if I switched the face more blue? It's three minutes in, we got some time, we got some time. Not Russian. We have a little bit of time. Let's see, what are we going to use here? We don't have much blue. We can use purple. Do I even have a blue 2x3? Or 1x2? I don't think I do. It's 
So I'm going to put Oop, eyes are a little catty monkish. Where does that word come from, catty monkish? That's a crazy word. Is that is that polar bear? Uh, not so much. What do I not like about it? There's something I'm not liking about this. I mean, it it's sleeping. Is that my problem with it? It's sleeping. Little arms. It's more like a yoga pose than anything else. So I'm a little, maybe that's why I don't like it. I don't like the pose. Maybe if I can add some actual feet. Just trying to change it up. I mean, I'm already, I, I'm gonna declare it was done. That's not bad. We gotta wake him up now though. If he's standing up, we can't have it sleeping and standing at the same time, right? If you're, if you're sleeping, then you're falling over, right? Googly eye. You know what it looks like to me? It looks like a Yeti. That's what it looks like. It looks like a Yeti. So maybe we built a Yeti instead of a polar bear. I mean, a polar bear is more like this, right? But this is a, more like a Yeti. That's kind of cool. I'm going to call this a Yeti. So instead of a polar bear or a bear, we built ourselves a Yeti. That's really cool. <coughs> Excuse me. So just a little bit extra time. We did the polar bear, but a little extra time. Now we have a Yeti. And I think that turned out fairly well. Okay. Very cool. Um, it, make sure that if you want to play along, make sure that you go click on the link down below that takes you to Amazon. And you can buy this kit for around $15. And um, if you want to share your creations with us, just go and hashtag make share daily. And make sure to share it on our social medias. Now let's go to check out what we built or what we're going to need to build for tomorrow. Okay, let's go check it out. Well, that was fun. Now we got to go into our next theme. So we've completed our winter themed items. Now we're going to go into something else. I actually have seen a couple YouTube videos talking about will this boat, Lego boat float. So I want to make a couple boats out of our 221 pieces that we have. A couple of those boats and then see if they if I can make something that floats so I got some boats on the on the board we're gonna spin the wheel and find out what we're going to build tomorrow again the objective is to make it um, float so an ocean liner that's fun um, I as soon as I think ocean liner I think of the Maersk Lego boat I don't know if you've ever seen it I'll show a picture up there but it's a really cool Lego boat uh, cargo boat. I don't think it's floatable though. So let's go see if we can make one that floats. Okay, let's go check it out. And I'll leave you with this. I want everybody in our community to make something and share something each and every day. That's the whole point of this channel is to have a community of makers going ahead and making whatever they love to make. I think you'll be happier and more engaged in life if you just go ahead and make something today. Thanks everybody for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.